Hello everyone, Venus here. For those that don't know me, I'm the creator of the biggest modification for Total War Warhammer 2 game, SFO Grimhammer 2 mod. And today I would like to invite you on a journey, on a journey of the passion project of mine that I had in works for quite some time. I invited several people to celebrate release of Warhammer 3 and we decided to make a real life Chaos God symbols. So let's grab a cup of tea. Or a bloody chalice and watch the whole process together. Remember, stick to the end of the video to see more Warhammer free stuff that we prepared for you. Let's go! All the passion for fantasy that I have came from my dad. He was reading Lord of the Rings to me when I was a child in such a way that I was able to understand everything without any problems. We talk about fantasy books and watch those types of movies to this very day. He carved the chaos symbols fully by himself from plywood, because normal wood would crack. Then, that prepared them for the journey ahead, the place where they will receive the final form. As you can see, my hands were never fitting for the physical work. Spooky Rat Studios are professional tabletop painters. They specialize in Warhammer, so I thought they would be the best for the job. In the past, they painted robot Gulliman for me. In a way, no one dares to call him Smurf. The idea of these chaos symbols came from one simple thing. Chaos is my favorite Warhammer fantasy faction. So why not make it real and be able to look on them every single day on my shelf? All symbols have to have a black base. It's much easier to add different corals later when you're painting them. I myself was painting Lord of the Rings tabletop in the past, but sharing it could be a very nerve-wracking. Airbrush is a tool used to add the most important colors. The paint used is from Citadel, so it's the same paint used in the official Warhammer tabletop. There is no better corn red than Citadel corn red.
Each symbol is not just plywood, but also has unique parts from official Warhammer models, blood letters, keepers of secrets, and so on. We used aspects from various models linked with every god to give them a unique feel. Some nasty Nurglings are needed on every Papa Nurgle symbol. To make each symbol unique and fitting to the specific god, it was very important to work on those small details. Full focus, precision, whole time was required. Handmade details and special effects, in combination with the rich stance, gives the full, unique effect these symbols deserve. And love. A lot of love was put in those symbols. Zinch is the great deceiver and changer of ways, overambitious to the point of contradicting and undermining his own plans, the master manipulator of time and knowledge. The more you know, the worse the fate will befall you, and many, many hard words. Nurgul is a father of decay, despair and death. Flies are everywhere and everything is horrific and disease. But usually, he grants his followers immunity to pain. It's very helpful considering your guts are outside your body from time to time. Slanish is the prince of pleasure and lord of excess. Lust, pride and self-indulgence are the hallmarks of all who follow it. Generalists and open to all and any suggestions. Slanishy content is never Peggy 13.
Korn is the god of war and murder, sitting on his skull throne. Despite magic in all forms, he doesn't care who dies, his followers or his enemies. All is well, as long as the blood flows. Never-ending blood for the blood god. I hope you liked the video from the whole process, but it's not over. From now on, from releasing of this video, every week you will be able to win those Chaos Symbols along with Total War DLCs, Hulia games and fully painted tabletop made by Spooky Rat Studios. Remember, you have time until release of Warhammer 3. And there is only one condition, you have to be an SFO Mod Team Patron. All information about contests and raffles that will be every week are in the pinned comment below. I hope all of you like what we did and thanks for the support. Without you, we would never be able to do such creative stuff. Vendris out! So let's... You uh, us. For those that want to have those chaos symbols on their show... Okay. Właśnie. Rozprasza niestety.